An innocent four-year-old killed when two shooters spray bullets into a car at a red light. And a two-year-old boy in the back seat was also grazed by a bullet. Good evening, I'm Vicki Yates. And I'm Rory Johnston. Police say this shooting was not random. The vehicle was targeted. News Channel 5's Alexander Cohen talked with witnesses and police today. What's the latest, Alexander? Obviously, they're doing interviews, trying to figure out why this vehicle was targeted. No matter the motive, you have three innocent young children who got caught up in this. A baby's bottle and a car seat sat at the crime scene. I've never seen that like that. Police say just before 8 Tuesday evening, two shooters at a red light opened fire on a 22 year old driver in a Malibu at Dickerson Pike and Douglas Avenue. With an arm wound, he drove miles down the street to the family dollar with three children in the back seat. Four year old Talia Frazier was hit in the head with a bullet and later died. And she didn't do anything to anyone and she just had to lose her life. Two year old twin boys were also in the car. One of them was grazed by a bullet, but they're expected to be okay. It's terrible, man. Like, what the hell is really going on? I have four grown children, and, and, and you know, people have been doing things that has not been right all of everybody's life. Um, but how in the hell does this little girl sitting on his back seat like his kid catch some bullets from someone else? She don't even know nothing about it. Police say the vehicle was targeted and they're still trying to figure out why. It's not right. The 22 year old driver is the twins father and police say he drove to the family dollar because that's where their mom works. Witnesses told me they heard gut wrenching screams. I'm devastated. Both shooters are still on the run. If you have any information, call Metro Police or Crime Stoppers at 615-74-CRIME. Vicky?